I have been asked to speak a little bit about Sir Roland Richardson and that's really so we can properly introduce him to the Dreams Fine Art family of collectors. In the Caribbean, Sir Roland Richardson is a celebrity. I mean, he was knighted by the Dutch government. He's been featured in so many magazines and has all the accolades. He actually holds a position historically, but because he's alive today, which we're thankful for, uh, it's harder to define his career. If you ask me to speak about Dali or Picasso, I can quickly put them in a historical context, but with Sir Roland Richardson, I'll have to define it in a slightly different way. If you were to describe, let's say, Thai food, if you like Thai food, and say, oh, it's got a sweetness to it, it's such a incorrect way to describe a complex flavor because there's so many elements to it. And when it comes to Sir Roland Richardson art, you need to see his body of work to understand the subtleties and the reason he does each particular thing in an artwork. He works a plein air. He paints what he sees and he's not trying to invent a world. He's not trying to uh, create from fantasy and imagination. He's documenting the world as he sees it. And that makes him a very authentic artist, especially in the Caribbean, where his representation of flora and fauna will remain as a historical record throughout time. His depictions of the imagery that he sees, whether it's the sea grapes or mangoes, or of course, his so famous flamboyant trees, to see them in his collection of work is moving. He is in every way an extension of the tradition of art that came from such artists as uh, Claude Monet. As some of the great impressionists of their time, Sir Roland Richardson is of our time. For the discerning collector, it's important to understand that he is an important Caribbean artist to collect, perhaps the most important living Caribbean artist, and certainly the most important living impressionist Caribbean artists of all times. And I look forward to seeing you online or at our next event. Oh, oh,